Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome to Unit Lost. I am Stylosa. Let's talk about Hanzo. Now, none of these changes are on the PTR yet. Jeff has said Hanzo changes will go live very soon. However, let's just quickly discuss the changes that we won't see with Hanzo. Now, what they were trying to do is make Hanzo... Um, well, give him more consistent DPS, at least. I think that was the, the, the kind of the plan. So this is what Jeff spoke about in a developer update video. He said, there are no Hanzo changes just yet, but they are coming soon. These are the things they won't do. So they were going to replace good old Scatter Arrow. Now, everybody likes Scatter Arrow, don't they? It's a wonderful ability, uh, especially when it instantly kills you, right? <laughs> they were going to replace it with Piercing Arrow. Now, what this did is it was a rapid moving projectile. So much faster than the arrows I'm firing here. So if I like... I don't know, fire down there at one of the bots. There's projectile time. You know, the, it's taking time. I, I, From what Jeff explained, I think piercing shot was almost like a hit scan kind of arrow. Rapid fire sniper shot. But what made it special is it went through barriers. Now, this turned out to be a bad idea, so they decided to get rid of it. However, they actually introduced a new ability. So Hanzo, look, I'm pressing R on my keyboard now. You guys can probably hear me slamming the keys. There's no reload happening because Hanzo doesn't reload because every time he fires, well... He automatically reloads his bow. So the idea was, why don't they give him a reload ability? And what this ability was going to do was charge your sonic arrow and charge your piercing arrow, which scatter arrow was basically not in the game anymore. It was, it was piercing arrow. It would charge them faster. So you could hit reload now and charge them up instead of actually doing primary fire. So you would have the sort of the the choice to either do straight up damage or think, okay, I want to get a imagine this is piercing arrow, like a piercing arrow shot off. Okay, now I'm going to reload and then my piercing arrow is up again, and then I fire my piercing arrow. If that was my piercing arrow. You get what I'm saying? It was an ability to recharge your special arrows. However, it looks like they've decided against that as well. What they tried to do next was change Scatter Arrow. Now, with Scatter Arrow, you can bounce this bad boy off anything. We all know the old Scatter Arrow magic where you do this and it instantly kills pretty much anything on top of you. Or you could do things like this. And we've all seen this. Imagine my thing is always Hanamura, isn't it? Uh, first point. See that bot over there? I'm going to kill him with Scatter Arrow. Goodbye, bot. And he's dead. But that would be an Orissa, and it would take maximum damage. And look at me, I'm miles away, everything is all fine and dandy. So what they tried to do with Scatter Arrow, and Jeff said, this turned out to be a huge nerf, so they're just not going to do this, is only make it scatter off walls and scatter off ceilings. No longer could you fire this into the ground and, well, get this effect, yeah? That just wouldn't happen. You'd have to bounce it off the walls. And the other thing they did is they uh, limited the bouncing arrow effect to just one bounce so when you fight off a wall it would just it would do that there it wouldn't scatter you know we see those kind of scatter all over the place it wouldn't do that so the question is what are they going to do with hanzo well this is where the new ability comes in it looks like what they're going to do according to jeff from the developer oh. update but what the get out of it boss <laughs> uh, yeah it looks like what they're going to do according to jeff that was terrible die is give Hanzo a new ability that gives him the ability, ladies and gentlemen, to fire arrows off at a rapid rate. So, Jeff explained this as you would fire your arrows and sort of have a window, yeah? So, um, maybe you pop down your ability, like you press your E button, right? And instead of it giving you scatter arrow, it lets you fire arrows off rapid. So, maybe you get like, like a 50% increase in fire rate, yeah? So you're kind of firing off real quick, yeah? <laughs> like this. Imagine that's your fire rate for your fully charged arrows, but you can fire five off? That's pretty ridiculous. Now, I actually did think this would be a good idea. If you guys remember my video where I was talking about Hanzo, because the thing with this shot, scatter arrows, is sort of like, it does the damage instantly, but if you had to fire shots off like one, two, three, four, five, at that kind of speed, you have to still aim them. There's still skill involved. And they were doing the damage of a fully charged shot like this, but you're firing it off like that. That could be interesting. Maybe you could do that every, I don't know, 30 seconds or something. That would be cool. But the other ability, and this is the real insane ability. This is what my thumbnail was based on, ladies and gentlemen. Is they've given him, or they're going to give him, a horizontal leap. They're going to let Hanzo jump. Like, I mean, yeah, he can jump now. But they're going to let him leap. Now, I think this is because Hanzo does this in the Dragon cinematic. So, imagine if you're Hanzo, right? You might be able to just full-on jump up to that high ground there or use it to jump back. Jeff describes this as a disengage ability. To me, that is super interesting. So what it looks like Hanzo is going to be when he updates on PTR, and this apparently is going to be pretty soon, um, probably like maybe next week or so, is we might see Scatter Arrow 
Uh, I think we'll still see scatter arrow, but we're going to see a reload ability, possibly. Which lets you fire faster, which obviously is a buff. I think scatter arrow is probably only going to work off maybe... I, I don't know. They'll probably do something to scatter arrow because they can't just leave it as it is. Because that was the whole point of changing him. But then they're going to give him a horizontal jump. So he's going to be way more maneuverable. He's going to have the chance to rapidly fire and do damage. Like, just imagine these were fully charged shots. And something's going to happen to scatter arrow. These are really interesting times for Hanzo. Guys, go crazy in the comments below. The PTR is live right now. It has May changes, Doomfish changes, and the awesome Sombra changes on it. Hanzo is not live just yet, but it's just around the corner. Guys, I've been Salosa. This is Unit Lost. If you enjoyed the video, well, then like the video, subscribe to the channel, and uh, I am finally going to bed because I've just got back from LA, and possibly I've been awake for 30 hours. Good Lord. <laughs> Catch you on the next one, guys. Toodaloo.